together again My tears have stopped falling The long, lonely nights And now with an end The love that we knew Is living again And nothing else matters Cause we're together again Welcome to my window seat. I'm so glad to have you here. This place brings me a lot of comfort. I. Uh, I like to read here, and I like to dream about the garden that I someday hope to have, and I should be out in the yard instead working on. Um, and I do my interviews from here. I, I like to uh, talk on the telephone, and, and I look out the window, and I just kind of think, uh, oh, I'm talking to this person in Texas, so then I see the map, and I see the you know the person I'm connecting with down in Texas and then it's just kind of like those little arcs you see on the map of uh, where the airlines fly and um, that's kind of how I'm looking at tonight I'm kind of looking at um, I'm talking to you guys all in your own homes and um, I, I remember uh, one of the first times that I was on a television show I went to Toronto and I was on the Tommy Hunter show and I was really nervous and he was trying to, you know, kind of give me some pointers and kind of help me calm down a little bit. And he said, you know, just think when you look at the camera, think that you're looking into someone's living room and you're singing straight to them. So that's how I'm going to do it tonight. I'm going to be thinking about you guys um, at home. And I even put on fancy clothes because I wanted to, to seem like a real concert. And I thought, you know, you guys might be throwing your YouTube up on your TV set and you know you could have like one of those mammoth giant TV sets and I didn't want to be like too scruffy for you so I decided to dress up and make it into a real concert so you can get your your popcorn and your beverages <clears throat> of your choice anyway um, I miss you I miss playing live I miss the talks that we have after the shows and some of the discussions we have during the shows, which can sometimes be challenging, but I like it, actually, I love it. Um, I just thought I would sort of kick off the little home concert, just like I kick off my show at the buildings. So uh, I'm gonna start out with a couple, maybe even three songs off of my Aces album. Just where your love went wrong and I don't want to be standing here 
first one down. <laughs> I've got to blow out the cogs there. <clears throat> So uh, the Aces album is really sort of the thing that really got things, got the ball rolling for me. Um, and I owe a lot of gratitude for a, a lot of that to the great songwriters that wrote all these songs. Uh, it was funny because I was having a little trouble um, just getting Jimmy Bowen to understand me because he was not the one who signed me to the label. and and. Um, at first, you know, he had a hard time with my folk background. He just really uh, wanted to downplay that. But um, once Mary Chapin Carpenter started hitting and he understood that people actually liked that kind of music, <laughs> you know, he'd been producing Frank Sinatra and Dean Martin and people like that, Kip Carnes. <laughs> and um, so once he understood it, uh, he pitched me this song, and it's a great Cheryl Wheeler song, and I love it so much. My old friend said to me, I ain't being what I'm supposed to be. Well, I don't know, it could be true. guitars 
I named my guitars after um, the Mayberry family. <laughs> so this one is Andy. I've had him the longest. And uh, actually, I, I was thinking that was B, but I think B is my jumbo. I'm, that didn't sound nice, did it? I do have a, another one that's a small one that's called Opie. And uh, thank you to the Taylor folks for making fine guitars. Gosh, I was trying to think how long I've had this guitar. I think 30 years, something like that. It's an antique. I was only eight when I got it. I'm just kidding. I put a candle in the window. Take a picture of the wall Avoid all the places we go Wait around on your call There's a part of me that wishes Oh my dream And a part of me that prays that I'll wake up someday over you. I throw a penny in the river, thinking that'll bring you home. And throw another right. That you don't. There's a part of me that wishes all my dreams come true, and a part of me that prays that I'll wake up some. And a part of me that prays I'll wake up some sweet day over you. Thank you. I can hear you clapping. So, uh, just so you know, uh, there's not a camera crew here or anything. Uh, you know that I married a great sound engineer, producer guy, and he is um, also good with visual arts. So, we are doing this concert with two phones and a camera and a microphone. <laughs> but uh, I just wanted you to know that it's just my husband, Doug Kreider, over there behind the camera. <laughs> So uh, I was taking some requests from folks uh, during my last two Wind Down Wednesdays and someone asked me to play something like from my really old days, like from way back. And uh, when I first started out, I was traveling around the country and kind of just booking myself wherever they'd have me. I was doing open mics and I was, uh, you know, trying to do some of the big listening rooms like in Chicago and up in... Uh, Madison up into uh, into Minneapolis and I I 
learned this song because I heard a gal play, and I might I might have gotten to open for her at that time. And I heard a gal named Claudia Schmidt play this song, and she didn't play it. Uh, I don't think she even played it on the guitar, but it, um, my friend Lisa and I worked it out, and we uh, came up with a kind of a fun arrangement. And I haven't played it in a long time, and I'm keeping my fingers crossed. I would while away the hours conferring with the flowers, consulting with the rain. And my head, I'd be scratching while my thoughts were busy hatching if I only had a brain. I'd unravel any riddle for any individual in trouble or in pain. And my thoughts, I'd be thinking. I could even be a Lincoln if I only had a brain. Oh, I could tell you why the ocean's near the shore. I could think of thoughts I never thought before. Then I would sit and think some more. I would not be just a nothing, my head all full of stuffing. My heart all full of pain I would dance and be merry Life would be a ding a dairy If I only had a brain Ooh. So back in my uh, troubadour camper truck days. Uh, I used to travel a couple times. I took friends out on the road or they took me out on the road, whatever. Um, so I did have companions sometimes, but um, my tried and true, always loyal companion was my dog, Duchess. She's right here in this picture here. And uh, we went all over the place together. And one of my favorite memories uh, was that we took a trip out to a place that I used to love to play called Centennial, Wyoming. And Duchess and I stayed in, in a cabin out there. And we kind of based out of that place for a few weeks during the winter um, where I had to <laughs> basically chop wood and then stoke a, a potbelly stove. And then I had to cook on that as well, which uh, let me tell you, that was a new experience for me, even after all those Girl Scout years. But um, anyway, I would kind of, run up and down from uh the centennial was just a little bit up the mountain from laramie wyoming and then i'd go down to laramie and mess around there was a great uh, music store down there that i used to hang out uh, in acoustic music store and then i'd go down to boulder and play on the mall or i'd you know try to get little open mic gigs or do whatever i could do for a few dollars and everybody was great to me but um this is the, the town that I learned this song in, and I've been singing it for a really long time. I uh, had a, a cassette of Jerry Jeff Walker, and he sang this song on it. And it's just that song that I just, I always still do it in my show, even after all these years. Graveyard ship midnight till dawn. The moon was as bright as a reading light, or a letter from an old friend back home. He said last night I run on the Jenny. She's married and has a good night. Boy, you should miss the track. When you never come back, she's a perfect professional's wife. She asked me, Why does he write for his money? Why does he roll for short pay? He ain't getting Crazy out there. 
never seen a hawk on the wing Never seen a spring at the great divide No, they never heard old Cam Cookies Well, I read up the last of the letter Tore off the stamp for Black Jim Then Billy rode up to relieve me He just looked at the letter and grinned And he said, why do they ride for the money? Why do they roll for short pay? They ain't getting nowhere and they're losing their share. Oh, they all must be crazy out there. But then they've never seen the northern lights. Never seen never heard old Cam Cookie say Gosh, makes me think about the West. Um, speaking of that feeling, uh, I've always been the kind of person who just loves to get on the road, get out of town, especially if I need to clear my mind or whatever. Um, I always have kind of enjoyed that feeling of not knowing exactly what I'm going to see, not what I'm going to, you know, don't know exactly what to expect. And it feels like now. I wasn't going to talk about that much today, but I do feel like that. But it's not quite as a, a free feeling now that we're staying home. But um, this is a song about um, being free. Doug and I wrote this in, on an album a few years ago. I don't know. It's on one of them albums. Why open this space? 
shoulder surgery after that. <laughs> I haven't played that in a long time. But it was fun. It was a good time. You know, this seems like a good song to be followed by a Merle Haggard song. So a few years ago, I uh, recorded a whole album of Merle Haggard songs, 12 songs, and I called the album Lucky because I'm so lucky that I got to know Merle Haggard. How cool is that? Um, it was one of those things where I was kind of nervous about recording his songs. I, I wanted to have his blessing so I actually called him ahead of time and told him what I was doing and that I was you know not trying to do a tribute because he was working his tail off this is 2014 and he was out on the road all the time and uh, I just wanted him to know that I, I just thought it was a cool idea to for a girl to sing all of his songs because or a bunch of his songs um, because I didn't have to change anything you know, these songs, they're so incredibly universal that uh, I just really just, I might have changed like two or three words as far as gender-wise goes, but for the most part, they're just relationship songs. And this is uh, one I had to change a couple of words in, but that was it. And uh, I love this song because um, makes me think of growing up in Alito, Illinois, and my neighbor who was a country singer and sitting out on the porch and singing with him and everything. And I, and I love that Merle loved the record. It made me really happy.
So I want to play a new song for you. And uh, this is a song that I wrote with my husband, Doug Kreider. It's all one word, you know. And, uh, and Pat Bergeson, who played guitar with me for many years, uh, we were introduced to each other by Chet Atkins, and we've been best buddies ever since. So he's one of the most amazing musicians, guitar, harm uh, harmonica, uh, just, he's unbelievable. And he's a nice guy. Because he's from Illinois. How could he not be? Anyway, this is a bluesy little song. And uh, I need the perfect pick for it. This one's... Oh, that's it. Sweet words and pretty lights don't get my attention I don't go there anymore But then best laid plans and all my good intentions fly out the window when you walk through that touch you and each time I think I've learned there ain't no fireman coming to my rescue too late to save me so just let it already in my soul She thinks I'll come around I'm just gonna let her Let her keep on thinking I'm still in control It's too late It's too late Okay, that was fun. I like singing new songs. I'm gonna try another one. This is a, it's a debut. Let's see here. Make sure I'm tuned up. All right. I think 
this song is ready for a debut. I don't know what the deal is, but Doug and I have been writing all these songs in minor keys. And uh, I don't think it's because we're unhappy or anything. I think it's just, <laughs> just, it was a theme, I guess. All right. like I've sung it 20 times but it's still always really scary when you play it in front of people uh, let's see here I know I got some other challenge up my sleeve here I was gonna dig out a uh, one from an album I did called Sweet Danger this was uh, an album I made in New York City with the uh, inimitable Jason Miles and a uh, it actually uh, it actually went to number four on the jazz chart so uh, it's a 
So Jason is from the jazz world, and that's one of the things I love the most about my job is I've been able to meet so many cool people and great artists and musicians from you know all different types of music and and learn stuff from them. And so I went to New York to make this record with Jason. We, uh, it's a long story, but we became good friends and. Um, <laughs> We started with this song to sort of bond me with the band because I was really intimidated. It was, you know, all the guys from Saturday Night Live and the Letterman Show and all these jazz old cats that are uber cool. And uh, so this was the cover song that I, I chose to sort of bond us together and it made the record. Take away the biggest part of me. Ooh, no, baby, please don't go. And if you leave me now, take away the very heart of me. I just want you to stay A love like ours Is love that's hard to find How could we let it slip away We've come too far Tomorrow comes and we both regret the things we said today. If you leave me now, just singing a song. I mean, it's not weird when I'm here by myself and I feel like you're here with me, so it feels weird. Um, first song I wrote uh, with Patrice Berg and Gary Harrison. in the city. 
sail but Through the years and the kids and the jobs And the dreams that lost their way Sometimes we laugh, sometimes we cry, and sometimes we just break down. We're good now cause we have to be. Come to terms with our vanity. Sometimes we still curse gravity when no one is around. Oh, wow. I think it's time for me to bid you adieu for this little time period. And I want to thank you so much for tuning in. Um, I thought it could be kind of neat to finish up with a song, which is the sentiment of what I would like to happen, which is, I would really like to see you someday soon. There's a young man that I know His age is 21 Comes from down in southern Colorado Just out of the service He's looking for his fun Someday soon Going with him someday soon my parents cannot stand him Cause he rides a rodeo My father says that he will leave me Crying I would follow him right down The roughest road I know Someday soon Go with him someday When it comes to call, my pa ain't got a good word to say. I guess it's cause he's just as wild in his younger days. So blow you old blue northern, blow my love to me. He's riding in the night from California. Someday soon, going with.
with him someday soon. But when it comes to call, my pa ain't got a word to say. Guess it's cause he's just as wild in his younger days. So blow you old blue northern, blow my love to me. He's riding in the night from California. He loves his damn old rodeo. Much as he loves me someday soon, going with him someday soon, someday soon, going with him someday. And I hope to see you someday soon. Take care of yourselves. See you soon.